Hello guys and girls, Foxy Raven TV here with another Fallout 76 video and today we'll be checking out the Blooded Explosive Railway Rifle here and uh, yeah this is a 2 star only and uh, yeah it's uh, it's good enough in my opinion we do also have another uh, non-explosive here, the, um, the Blooded 50% Crit 1 Agility Railway Rifle here and um, these are my two railway rifles for the bloody build here and uh, here are our perk cards here i will just be going over them sw swiftly here so you can pause the video if you want to check out the build um, yeah this is uh, what i'm currently using and for the legendary perk cards it's as always fully Endurance, fully charisma, fully luck, fully perception, fully intelligence, and fully agility. For our mutations, we are using adrenal reaction, bird bones, eagle eye, e eagle eyes, egghead, muscle pail, scaly skin, and speed demon. We are fully fed because we are always on perfect bubblegum. Uh, <clears throat> yeah. And um, for the armor, it is just a whatever on a yielding set here for the secret service it's the first one i ever got and i'm not gonna roll any thing better than this i'm happy with with this and uh, yeah it's just the first that i ever got of the on yielding set here let's uh, get to it see what this bloody explosive railway rifle here can do that's a nuke and bound though but we are not gonna do that in this video here Let's see. You're gonna wake up. We have to shoot you. We do. That is a lot of damage there. So let's just fire one. That is a lot of damage. That's cr crit here. Holy smoke. Yeah, that's a lot of damage. And it died at seven shots and we even missed a few. So yeah. That is insane. Let's go get over to West Tech here. You can actually use the railway rifle in non-automatic, where you just press the button. But um, yeah, you can do you can use it as a rifleman's build as well if you want to. But I just like them being automatic. Uh, yeah, so it's it's a uh, down to preference what you like. I mean, if you use them as single target, I mean single shot fire, you can you can actually do the uh, the prime version. Off it as well and use ultra side ammo. And um, as you can see, we can actually use this more or less in stealth mode because we can hit from afar. And uh, and when we are hitting this hard, I mean, then then there's no reason to do a full automatic, and this only has ten bullets in it as well. So, in my opinion. Maybe a prime version of this would be actually better in terms of damage. Um, because you don't you don't really need it to be full automatic. I mean, it's only 10 bullets, right? So if you're only doing PVE, then it's... Then you should actually uh, make it a prime, in my opinion. But uh, yeah. And use it as single shot. But just for the sake of the video, we're doing this in... Actually, I think after this year, we will see if we can get down... Eh, we killed a lot of super mutants. Let's just get down and see if we can make it here. They might already have killed her when when we get down there. But I just want to see how good the uh, the non-explosive and, and explosive is against uh, the Scorsby screen. Hopefully she ain't dead. There was a lot of guys down there, a lot of people. This is th this is a little odd, uh, well, recording. <laughs> it's not as as we used to do. Is she dead? I think she is. Did the server die? What is going on here? She not dead. She is somewhere. She is... Where is she? 
What are they shooting? Oh, there she is. She almost dead though. So 270... 74 damage to the head. Don't think we dealed enough damage to her though. In order to get anything. And I'm stuck here. Great. Oh, we actually did. Holy smoke. Getting over encumbered now. Yep. Let's try it. Uh, normal scorch here. There we go. That was a grenade though. That was a body shot. <laughs> yeah, it is doing, doing alright, I have to say. It is. So let's... Uh, Let's not waste any more time here, and then let's go our over to the Myla Queen here. And I think we will kill two of her. I mean, one with the explosive and one with non-explosive, if we, if we can. She might already be dead, though. I don't see any Maya lurks here. Oh, there we go, it's up there. That was a body part. Look at that damage. That is wild. So little, little more than two clips and she's gone. That, ac that is actually not bad at all. Let's see, let's see. About the king over here. That was the explosive though. A crit here. Holy smoke, that that is a lot of damage. Look at that. <laughs> we tree shot at him. Can we crit? There we go. Fifteen hundred damage almost. Holy smoke. That is a lot. We're getting over encumbered if we take that, so we won't, we won't take it. We just won't. So uh, yeah, it is, it is insane. The explosive. Let's actually see if we can do another one here with the non-explosive here, just to compare them. <clears throat> I do have the explosive uh, under intelligence, so that is boosting our damage with the explosive one. But I just have the other one as a um, what do you call it? As a secondary weapon, really. If uh, if I need to switch fast, for some odd reason. But uh, anyway, let's check it out here. 951 damage with that non-explosive. That doesn't seem right. Let's check it out here, the king. 950, and didn't re register here. 950 and then explosive for 50, uh, that is a thousand. Switch over to the non-explosive again. That is, they're dealing the same damage. What? what? They're dealing the same damage. What is the point with the explosive then? So you get 82% 80, more from the explosive, is, is that it? Is that really it? Throw an 8 out here. Oh my luck queen, there you go. The non-explosive here guys and girls. Critical. 800. Yeah, I actually don't know. I, I think it, they're dealing the the same amount of damage. That is weird. This is just me. 
We need to test this further. What should we do? We can always kill a few of these up, up here. That is that is wild. So the explosive, if it only deals 88% more damage, not percent, but 88 from the explosive, then what is the point with an explosive? I mean, it, it clearly, the intelligent card says it deals more damage. And even if we look at them, it says it deals way more damage. I mean, if we take a look at them, right? This one deals 421. This one deals 319. Oh, now it's, now it's falling. It's because of the buff from the uh, whatever. But look at that. It is actually almost like 100 more. It's 96 more. Huh? That is a level 100 up there. Let's check it out again here. So here we have a 75 here, 914, 932. This one was a lower level though. Let's check it out again here. Come on, all minus. Nine hundred and fifty-one. Switching over to explosive. The same level. This one here. Yeah, it's the explosive actually don't deal that much more damage. I mean, not to a point where I really, really need the explosive. Uh, to be honest. Um, hmm. Yeah, the explosive is nice to have for sure, and it deals a, a little area damage, right? But if I don't have an explosive and just have a normal bloodied uh, without explosive, then that will be totally fine in my opinion. I mean, the damage difference is so tiny that it doesn't really matter. That is fun. That is a funny thing. Was a death claw. Another death claw down. Yeah, I, I'm not too sure what I what I think about this. Uh, don't feel like the explosive is that needed for a railway rifle. At least not a bloody it. But yeah, there you have it, guys and girls. Um, take care, and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.